Today we're doing one of our traditional fall activities. We're stocking trout into one of our local trout lakes. Well, hello, I'm Dave Weitzel. I'm the area fishery supervisor up here at uh, the DNR's Grand Rapids area office. The trout that we're stocking today, which happen to be rainbow trout, they're really not a lake species. But what we found uh, over the years, going all the way back to uh, at least the 1940s, is that um, number one, anglers really like having some opportunities to catch some of these trout. Uh, and number two, when we stock them into lakes like this, they'll, they'll usually grow uh, fast enough to produce a, a pretty decent quality trout. In a lake like this one, uh, we routinely see trout growing to 14 inches their first year. If we're lucky enough to have them survive longer than that, we can see some 16 inch trout. I've even, even heard of some 20 inch trout coming out of Moonshine Lake. With kind of some changes in the climate here in northern Minnesota, we're having to adapt our fish management strategy. Uh, the good news is we still have some tools to use to maintain a good trout fishery on lakes like Moonshine. But instead of stocking these little trout and needing to give them time to grow up, well now we have to rear these fish at a hatchery and get them up to a size where they're already desirable to anglers at the time that we're stocking them. Moonshine Lake is primarily managed as a winter fishery. When the winter trout season opens in mid-January, we hope anglers will put their trout stamps to good use and utilize the resource.